Hey guys, this is 2006 Lexus GS300. The problem I'm having is this. You see that rear sunshade? It doesn't go up all the way. It comes down all the way. But it doesn't go up all the way. So today I'm gonna try to find out what's going on. I actually haven't used it in a while so I had to actually look up the instruction on how those of you that also forgot remember this is on your uh, your gadget control panel here and it's this button at the top here all right before we can remove the back seats uh, move your front seat all the way to the front as far as it will go and then Tilt the uh, the back. Same thing on the passenger side. Okay, so for the back seat, what I did was I just lift it up here. Okay, lift it up, and then I pulled it out. So let me show you what it looks like. So when you lift it up, you're pulling it out of here. And then on the other side, there. So I'm doing this for the first time. So I'm trying to figure this out as I go. Uh, looks like we're gonna have to remove this and this one here for the seat belt. Uh, this one, I don't think we have to remove. Uh, I think we're gonna have to remove that, okay? So you got three nuts on each side, so total six. This one is our 12 millimeter. Next one, that's a 14 millimeter. We have 12 here. Another 12 on this side. So while editing the video tonight, I noticed one of the section didn't get recorded so this is the uh, uh, middle seat belt okay uh, that one here uh, you'll have to loosen a bolt here I'm not sure what that was uh, I think that was 12 it's either 12 or 14 okay and then you have the, uh, the clip here okay Basically, uh, you push down, okay? You actually, you push down from the, the little blue color mark. You push down here, and then you pull it out, okay? Okay, this is 14. Here. Okay. okay, next underneath the seatbelt looks like there's a three 
Phillips head uh, screws in there. Uh, so for these screws here, they're in a really tight spot. So if you get a, a screwdriver, it may not fit. So what I did was uh, I got the quarter inch ratchet and this is a, a quarter inch socket. And I got a, a screwdriver bit here. It keeps coming out, so I taped it on. So the regular screwdriver bit fits into the quarter inch socket. So I'm gonna let my wife hold this. Okay, make sure you let that out. Just push it to the back. This middle seat belt, uh, it also has a couple of Phillips head screws. So we're gonna take those out as well. You don't have to take out the headrest uh, if you don't want. You can just uh, raise it up. But this thing here, you're gonna need one of these. Uh, just pry it out. There's nothing holding it. Uh, just a little clip here. So you can just pry it out. And then inside, there's a 12 millimeter bolt, nut. You're gonna need a long extension. Okay, it's gonna look like this. Once you take out those uh, two bolts on the headrest, it should just pop out like this. Once you loosen those uh, two bolts, two nuts behind the headrest, it should just lift out. Okay, so you see, it was just two bolts holding the back. Okay, so I got the uh, the rear back seat back taken out. It looks like this. Actually, it's not often that I'm gonna have to pick off the back seat. So let's see what's behind the felt sheet here please like and subscribe and i'll see you guys next time